Welcome back. This is episode 9 and this time we're gonna be playing a soldier because he's the only character that I have at the moment that I haven't killed his past. I haven't completed the past quest, I guess. And we're going to also attempt to collect the 120 shells and 3 keys if it's possible, but it all depends on luck because I have to get lucky to get the room reward that is the key. But to increase my chances of getting room rewards, I have to also not get hit, so I'll try to concentrate better this time and avoid the damage. Okay, first room clear. I don't know by how much uh, it increases the chance of getting items, but I know it stacks with time, so... Hopefully, I get at least one key like this, and then maybe I can collect enough money to by the to pay off the elevator guy so he can repair it so far so good still not still didn't take any damage my fingers that I'll get a key and not a ammo or something because that I don't need that I don't need ammo I don't, I don't have any other weapon but this and I'm not gonna have any other weapon since I have to hold on to my keys so I'll have to fight the boss with this weapon which isn't the worst but you know there's more enemies almost got hit there because I got Pushed back by the explosion. Almost hit the enemy. Luckily I didn't. Half a heart. Damn it. Now my room reward is gonna get reset. Then I'm... I don't know how many rooms was this. I can count them I guess. To approximately see... How many rooms I have to clear before I get another reward. So that was one, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, it can be less than that, it can be more than that. Okay, let's destroy the chest since I'm not gonna be opening it. Maybe I get the Junk Warrior guy, the Junk Knight. Uh, boss room, okay. Come on, I need some keys. And I need more money because I have a pretty low amount of money. Okay, the shop. I'm not gonna buy keys yet because. Well, because I don't know whether or not I'm gonna get lucky. And if I buy a key, I'm probably not gonna get enough money. Unless I find the doctor lady, the vampire lady. She's not a doctor, she just looks like that because of the white rope thing. Okay. An empty room. That's unfortunate. That's highly unfortunate. Oh, I got the soaker. That's nice. The dozer, I guess. It's a decent weapon for pushing people off the ledges, but other than that, it's pretty much useless. It doesn't do any damage. I mean, it does damage, but it's not a lot. I think it does less than my starting weapon another half a heart who would have known you know what I'll buy the key and go to the boss fight and hope that I get uh, get this boss done without getting hit although this is gonna be pretty tough because the pigeon is pretty tough when you don't have anything to hide behind Concentrate a bit more to dodge his bullets. You have to keep your distance because then there's less of a chance that he'll hit you. Almost dodged into a bullet. That's not good. That's not what you want to do. Now he's gonna try to blow me up, but that's fine. 
just gonna dodge all of that. Okay, reload. Halfway there, approximately. Oops, almost hit. Almost got hit by the chandelier, which is not optimal. Okay. I saw the bullet and I didn't activate the blink. I don't know why. Maybe I'm just slow today. Okay, I got hit second time. This is mostly because with time I lose I lose concentration and then since I'm shooting this boss for like half an hour since I don't have a better weapon at, at the moment. And I'm not gonna get any keys here as well. well that's unfortunate. I got the blood eye slower enemy bullets. Well that's nice I guess. You know what? I'll go for the secret level. I mean what do I have to lose aside from this game, this run, but uh, which room, which room was it, I forgot which room it was, was it down here somewhere, oh it can't be this, right, I totally forgot, oh it's all the way down, I remember now, okay, we're gonna make our way there, I'm there, I'm pretty sure there's a barrel in here, so if you want to get it off the wall, you can push it into the wall and then it bounces. You want to break everything in its wake because I think it, if it touches the table it breaks, which sucks. Okay, here we go. Essentially you need two keys to enter the room in the that level, so... I'm gonna waste all my keys and it's unlikely that I'm gonna collect three keys in this area. And it's unlikely that I'm gonna survive this area because I have only... The starting weapon and the enemies here are not easy. Uh, that slime that's shooting has the rotation ability that we've seen before when the die roll slime, die roll enemy shoots because he can copy any slime's attack. Okay. First room clear, at least something. Eh? There's the, the basic enemy of this map. I'm gonna attempt to those to push this guy into the the hole. Nice. Another one. Nice. So but this is basically how you use this weapon. You just push things into holes. Second sniper. I presume there's more snipers on the other end. Yeah. As you can tell, probably already that there are a lot more tougher enemies in this map than it usually is in the second chamber. I guess. What it called? I'm gonna go back here to dodge this. I'm not gonna risk actually dodging. These shotgun guys are pretty annoying. Nice. Exactly what I wanted. Not. Actually, I mean, I have a gun that I can reload, but it's not what I wanted at all. I want to kill this guy as soon as possible because his bullets are faster. Oh no. Oh boy. How many enemies? A lot of enemies. I don't like that. Now, unfortunately, this is gonna take a while because of the fact that I don't have any good weapons. This is why I avoided this in the first place because it's they're tougher enemies and you have to shoot them more, and it just takes more time. And of course, I usually die at this level when I don't have anything good. Okay. Okay, it's this slime. I thought it was maybe the the other guy. Okay, again, something I don't really need. Let's go and check out what this guy has. Only one key. I can sell stuff. Huh. We'll see about that. Maybe we can gather enough keys. If we get... 
at least one key from the boss room or somewhere along the way. I can probably get enough keys. I'm gonna distance this enemy from me a little bit. So I can have more room to move. Maneuver. I noticed that this microphone, even though it captures my voice better and it doesn't capture my breathing as much, which is also really nice, it, but it captures my mouse clicking very loudly. I don't know why my mouse is on a different side of the table entirely and I'm basically leaning over to this microphone so I can talk into it. I'll have to order a better mic, that's the only solution here really. I'm gonna leave the chest just in case I don't... Okay, I'm not gonna collect this yet. Even though I don't plan on going against the old king, because he's gonna wreck me. He's really tough and you need better weapons for him. Usually I defeat him by going on to a rainbow run. Because then you get items for each stage and usually you get pretty good items. And it's easier like that. I mean it's possible to defeat him with shitty weapons, but it takes time again. Time I don't wanna waste. Especially when I'm recording, and then the video is going to be even longer than they already are, and they're already too long, in my opinion. Like 40, 50 minutes, that's all. Long video. Long time to sit down and watch someone play video games. Come on, die already. Jesus, they take so much damage. Get pushed. The, the guys that split the bullet, like shoots in splits, are usually not that tough when they're alone because you can just stand in front of them and they're never, never going to hit you because their bullets split. But when they're combined with others, it gets tough to dodge them. Oh yeah, that's one of the, one of the poop jokes in this level, that little guy. He's like a corn and he comes out of the enemies. Then you can shoot him and he turns into a popcorn. I still haven't gotten a single key as a room reward, which is really unfortunate. I have to distance the enemies as far away from me as possible, so I have a better chance of dodging. Now if I had an electrocute weapon or an electrocute bullets, that would be really nice, because then I could just soak the entire room and electrify everyone in it, but I don't. Which is unfortunate. What can you do? Okay. I guess I'll go this way. Okay. I'm going right. Fuck this. Yeah. That was oil. That's why it burnt. These kind of barrels are oil barrel barrels. The other chest is also green. Of course I get good chests when I don't want to open them. But who knows if I'll get a key from the boss. Who knows if I'll survive the boss even. But I wanted to show this... This level, this chamber. The first secret chamber. Lots of snipers. I'm gonna use the corners. I'm gonna have to stop using the corners because there's grenades. Oh. Again with the ammo. Why can't I just get a key? God damn it. Yeah, come here, get poisoned. There we go. Very nice. So far so good. I thought I would lose more HP by now. Okay, so we got zero keys from that. We can only hope that I'm gonna get a key from the boss. I'm gonna take the shield because, like I said, I don't plan on going the, to the second secret level. But you essentially need this to get there. You need to preserve it because if you get hit, it, it's lost. It's like an armor, basically. And this is the boss. He's not the toughest boss, but he's got a lot of HP and I'm gonna have to shoot him with this gun. 
it's gonna take a long time. There's not much I can do there. Because, well... Yeah, he goes with that thing. Throwing up again. You wanna stay away from him, just like any other boss, basically. So you have more time to see the attacks and dodge them. Okay, this is not gonna be nice to dodge. Oh god, I knew it. I didn't want to use a blank, I don't know why. I don't really care about that armor, to be honest. And this attack you want to stand as far away as possible, but not close to walls because they bounce. But there, I dodged it successfully this time. So we're not even halfway there. I don't know, does this do more damage perhaps? Maybe. Because it's a continuous stream and I don't have to reload. So maybe this is better for this boss. Stay as far away as possible. There we go. Yeah, this definitely does more damage than the beginning weapon. I guess I was wrong. Okay. Almost there. Only like a quarter left or something. Goes this attack. Throwing up attack. Okay. Come on. Like I said, this boss is not that tough. His attacks are pretty easy to dodge. That attack is just annoying because he disappears during the duration of this attack. There you go. Get wrecked. No keys. For some goddamn reason, I still want to try and collect three keys. I don't know why. But I guess I'll attempt it. I buy the key here. And sell pretty much everything I have. Seventy nine, eighty two. Uh, I'm gonna drop this gun. You know, I'll drop this gun as well. I have enough money, but I don't have enough keys, and it's too bad you can't give him money on one round and then keys on the other. Ooh, if I only knew I was... This thing gives you 500... 500 uh, money, shells, whatever. Oh, if I only knew I was gonna get it, I wouldn't... I would have saved up my weapons. I should have brought... I should have broken the chest first, my mistake. So here we go, stage 2, hopefully I can get 2 keys, because I have more than enough money now. If we get lucky, the shopkeeper is gonna have 2 keys and then I can just buy the keys and be done with it. But I don't think I'm gonna be that lucky, so I just hope that I get some keys. From clearing the room, so I'm gonna try to concentrate extra hard to not get hit, so I can increase the odds of getting things from rooms. And now that I don't have any other weapon, I'm hoping that the game isn't gonna give me ammo. Ah, god. I hate the spikes, I never see them. I messed up this room. God damn it. And I'm still gonna get something and I'm gonna get ammo, of course. Of course I'm gonna get ammo. What else would I get? God damn it. I really wanna complete this quest. But the luck is not on my side, unfortunately. 
there's a prisoner. Oh my, no, we're not doing that. I almost got poisoned. Key. Now the shopkeeper only has to have one key, and I have enough. Come on. Come on, come on. Another key. Die. Yes, I got him. Now I have enough already. I guess I got lucky in the end. This thing uh, kills the guy that is at the bottom that's giving him the extra health. Ah, who cares? I got the key. I mean, I do care because I still have to go all the way and kill the pest and I have zero weapons. And I have failed the first boss challenge. Let's go to the elevator first. And complete this quest already. Yes, you can have that. Oh, come on. How much do I have? I have 11. That's nice. Then I can... Oh, God damn. Then I can immediately complete this. Hey, there you go. Finally. Jesus. That guy requires too much things to unlock. It's not worth it at all. Yes, give me the key, please. Now I'm going to at least be able to unlock a one chest at this level. Maybe I get lucky and get more keys, who knows. That would be nice. Oof, almost got hit there. By the bounce. Okay, let's go up, I guess. I'm not sure if I need to go for this. Maybe these two rooms connect. We'll see. another key please oh of course what the hell I didn't know that that was the sound they make when they charge I haven't played this in a while so I totally forgot that was the sound I was I didn't know what to expect to be honest yeah these two rooms connect so I don't have to go through the trap room risk getting hit for no reason this annoying enemy when there are eyes glow I think that's when they do damage getting careless that's not good I don't have to go here uh, give me the heart I mean I'm rich I'm r rich Circling enemies is a really good strategy because they essentially don't hit you like ever. But only when you can do that. Sometimes you can't because there's volumes or the enemies are too fast. Now I get a half a heart, of course. I don't need it anymore. I haven't seen the caped guy in a while. This would be a really bad room for the cape guy, because he could get just hit by this thing and die. Oh, let's roll the dice. Unsteady shielded. I guess I got an armor? Some armor? And an unsteady sounds like my aim got worse, but I don't really notice it much. Oh. I thought it was a horizontal room. Didn't even notice that there was more things down there. Come back. Jump the gap. Oh. What's this? Freeze ray. Ice to meet you. Now that's the... The pun from the movie. The Batman movie with Arnold, I think. 
Can I freeze the boss? Yes, I can. Then he shoots slower. Which is really nice. I don't know how much damage it does. It does decent damage, I guess. Freeze. This is really nice. Ooh. I'll try to freeze this guy immediately. I guess it, this is kind of the ray that he uses in that movie. Unfortunately, this weapon charges and I can't really use it while he's lasering me. Get rid of that guy as quick as possible. I'm not freezing him anymore. What happened? I became immune to my freezes. And he spawned the guy at the worst fucking moment. And oh, now this is gonna get tough because I don't have any other weapon. that I can avoid the small guys in the meantime. Oh, he spawned one right in front of me. I'm not gonna be able to avoid this one. Reload! Oof. Barely. Barely managed to do this without getting hit. Now this is not a bad item, but at the same time I don't really need it. I didn't think I could do that, but I could. Whatever, it's okay, it's fine. Junk. We can unlock this guy. I think he also appears at the hub, so I'll be able to purchase stuff from him as well. I don't need that. Let's go to the third stage. Okay, the third stage... Uh, we're not well equipped for this stage's boss. Since we only have one weapon. And I don't think it's that good against bosses. I mean, it's nice I can slow down their fire, but... doesn't do that much damage. There we go. Another half a heart. I'm trying to see if I can find the door, but it seems like it's invisible or something. I can't locate it at all. Whatever. Let's just continue. Okay, one down. There's a lot of them. But now they're all mostly dead. Nice. It's still not over. Come on. I definitely made the right call going down into the sewers. I got lucky. Now that we've completed that quest, the next run I'll attempt to uh, I'll attempt to unlock the robot character. Oh, nice. I don't know which character I'll use for the journey. I might take the pilot because he can hold the second item and the robot is the second item basically. Hmm. I'm definitely not going to open a blue chest. I don't have keys at all. So I'm definitely not going to waste one on a blue chest. Ooh. Why would I even go across? 
What's that noise? Oh, it's... It's that guy. God damn it. And he split. And I... I hit both of the fake ones, which is unfortunate. But it's fine, I still have a decent amount of HP. Oh, thank you. No capes. Unfortunate. Oh, another glass shard. I just have to be careful to not get hit and before I get hit immediately. Okay, more enemies. Nice. Come on, better chest. A, A brown chest. Even better. Of course I'm gonna get unlocked with the chest now. Damn it. Let's hope I can make this work somehow, even with these shitty weapons. It's gonna be tough, that's for sure. Maybe the shopkeeper is gonna have a weapon that I can buy. Even if it's not that good, I might just buy it. Because I need weapons. Okay, nice. It would have been better if I got the... If I got the... Full ammo, because I don't have multiple weapons and I don't need a partial refill for all of them. Okay, let's get out of here before the bullets decide to travel my way. Okay, I'm not gonna continue doing that. Wizard is somewhere far away again. Where is he? Come on, appear closer. Nice. When he's next to the wall, he shoots his bullets into a wall, which is nice. Now I can't go up there. I have to go around. Oh boy. I'm in a bit of a pickle. Luckily, I got myself out of that pickle. I have to start eliminating some enemies, even if it's the weaker ones. That was a terrible dodge, and it's still... I guess it maybe got defended by the glass shards. How much health do these things have? Jesus. Oh boy. They have a lot of health, and I have shitty weapons. Unfortunate combination. I don't need health, I need more keys. More weapons, anything. I, I wish I could get the guy that has the game that I can unlock a chest with. That would be really nice, but I don't think I'll get that. One can dream. Okay, there we go. Okay, more enemies, grenades. By the looks of it, I'm gonna be fighting the tank boss because there's way too many soldiers. Which is unfortunate because that's the worst boss and I don't have a good weapon. Come on, something, anything. Angry bullets, I'll take it. What's this? Wolf, I'll take it. I mean, I have so much money. And wolf attacks, which is nice. What do the angry bullets do? I forget. Oh. Not, not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, boss room. Hm. Oof. This is not worth it at all. I have only one key and there's a blue chest in there. Now, how much bullets do I have for this? I'm gonna have to buy the bullets. Because I need to at least have one gun against this enemy. This boss. Yes, it's the tank god. Fucking damn it. Get frozen. Do you want to be a nice man? Chill out. 
I don't know how to do an Arnold impression, so I apologize. At least I can slow him down. Ooh, baby. Damn, he's fast. Not even halfway there. This is gonna be a long fight. It's like highly unlikely that I'm not gonna get hit in the in the meantime. Because there's way too many things to follow at once and there's he spawned these goddamn enemies all the time. I'm gonna summon up my reload thing. Ah oh, god damn it. Take it! Go wolf! He just charges me like that, what am I supposed to... Fuck. This boss is the worst, like... This boss and the master boss, the master of the cult or whatever. They're the two worst bosses. Then there's the Amaconda, which is also a really annoying boss. Die! Thank you. Okay, I got my health back at least, and I got a weapon, which is nice. And it's not a bad weapon either. Oh, these guys just die? I thought that they might be crying as well, but they're not. Oh. I guess that's it for this level. I got some good weapons at least. Going on to stage number four. It's going to be... Well, it's going to be challenging for sure. Hopefully I get better chests this time. I don't see... They're not really bouncing it. At other enemies, which is weird. Nice. Wolf is really good. I like the wolf. They just seem to bounce randomly. Okay, I'm gonna hide here. Go, wolf. Nice. Can I pet you? Apparently not. Eh, unfortunate. They seem to bounce a lot. Like, almost every bullet bounces. I thought it said a chance to bounce, not almost always gonna bounce. Oh boy. The wolf is a really nice companion. He does quite a lot of damage, I think. I'll see. I'll see about it. I'm desperate. It's unfortunate when you don't get any good chests. Go oh, wolf. Kill him. Very nice. Well, I guess the die guy killed himself. Maybe. Because I didn't notice. Maybe the wolf killed him. I don't know. Oh, whoa. Nice. Let's go. Who's next? Oh, there's the guy that spawns. Damn it. Almost got hit there. Oh, the wolf eliminated both him and another one? That's nice. Uh, where's the thing? I mean, I have full ammo. Ah, the rat. The rat can take it, I don't care. Okay. That's nice that the wolf can hit him because he doesn't fire bullets. There we go. Freeze the 
Reaper. Now I can go and get rid of this guy before the Reaper shoots. Nothing up here. Oh no. Go, Wolf. Eliminate this thing. You're not gonna get away with it. Get back here. Wolf caught. Attack. God damn it, I should have used a different weapon sooner. My mistake. Oh, come on. Jesus. That was close. Uh, where's the blank? Oh, it's up there. Three blanks. Let's see if we can get more keys. Of course we can. I'm not gonna buy anything else. I don't think it's worth it. The final level usually has some good items in the shop, so... At, at the forge. So hopefully... Hopefully I don't die before I get there. Hopefully the second chest is better. Oops, I got stuck on the wall. Okay, still no... God damn it. I'm not paying enough attention. Okay, the second chest is here. Two and a half hearts. They're not looking very hot right now. I'm gonna have to pay more closer attention to the enemies. Nice. Now I could use those half a hearts that I keep getting randomly when I don't need them. But of course, now I'm not gonna get them. Okay, more enemies. Oh, of course. Of course it was this guy that spawned there. God damn it. I don't remember if the shopkeeper had any hearts. If he did, I'm gonna have to buy them because... I don't wanna risk losing against the boss. Oh, there's a half a heart. Nice. Come on, green chest at least. Yes! Crutch? <laughs> what the hell does it do? Aim assist. I don't need aim assist. God damn it. I might just have to open the bull chest. Oops, sorry. Reload stone. Yes, thank you. I'm gonna take that. Also gonna sell all the junk. How much does the golden junk is valued at? How much? Ah, same as the normal junk. But it doesn't matter. Sure, I'll sell all the junk. Drop it. I don't need junk, so it's fine. I still have a decent amount of money. Uh, let's go check out the shop. No, he doesn't have any health. He has the armor, but I need. I don't want... Huh, should I open it? Nah, I'm fine. I'm gonna use the Tommy gun. And I have the reload stone. And it's these guys. What's really nice about this now is that I can just use the reload stone and clear everything. And then once it's done, I can just dodge for these things because it's now a lot simpler. I'm hoping that the bouncing of the bullets is gonna get some of them. Ah, fucking. I thought they were gonna shoot the second time they bounced, but they didn't. This should last me long enough to pick up at least a little bit of that. How many fucking times do I have to shoot them before at least one of them dies? 
Okay, there we go. One's down. Screw yourselves. Other one down. Oh boy. I thought it was gonna be the other one. I was wrong. I'm gonna activate the reload stone. To gather up some ammo. Ooh, that was close. Nice. And we get some health back. I think this is pretty good. Unfortunately, this is not good. Like fish in a barrel. Fifth stage. Here we hope to... We hope to get some good items from the shop. I mean, I have a decent amount of money. I should be able to buy. God damn it, I hate this hammer. No, get away from me. Oh boy, oh boy, and there's more. God damn charging, guys. Take the fish. No, stop it. Stop trying to squish me. I have to be careful, I don't have that much HP. Oh great. This is not what we want to see. A big open room with shitloads of enemies. And there's more. Didn't even notice that guy. Luckily, he didn't hit me. Take the fishes. They're actually not that bad. Oh boy. They're actually decent. They do a decent amount of damage. I thought they were gonna shoot, but they all stopped shooting as soon as I activated my reload stone. There's someone honking outside. That's not nice. I hate this thing. Okay, where's the real one? Kill it. I have one and a half heart. This is not looking good. I need health. Bad. Die. Wait, he's still not dead. Jesus. Nice. Okay, the first chest is up here, but I would rather find the forge, I think. Instead, I found the boss. Fine, let's go for the chest. Oh no. Really? Maybe I get some health from it. That would be nice. Yes. Thank you. Hmm. These guys don't spawn that many bullets, I don't think so. I'll save my reloads for a defensive usage. Yo, Wolf, kill him. Wolf, why are you not attacking? Okay, here we go. You know what, I'm activating it. 
I don't wanna risk closing help. I know this is, wasn't the best room to use it in because the enemies didn't do much. I didn't want to get hit by the mage. Okay, let's see. Come on, chest. Shadow bullets, nice. Not bad at all. Oh, what? Where the hell? I didn't even see him. Charge my weapon and get a key. Here's the bullet, thank you. I'm thinking whether the second chest is worth it, but it probably is. Go wolf. Okay, the second chest is all the way up there. I'm not leaving this spot. I'm just staying here. Pitching a, pitching a tent. Like I said, this enemy cannot hit you if you just stand in front of him. This thing should not reach. Nice. And they're all dead. So far so good. Let's continue with the... Oh, what the fuck is this? Oh boy. I don't like the looks of this. I don't like the looks of this at all. No. When I have the immunity, Ugh. come on, at least be worth it. Okay, it's a weapon, I'll take it. Damn, I have one and a half heart and three blanks. I do have a reload stone, so perhaps, perhaps we can do this. I don't know, I think the Tomigan is still the best one I have at the time, but we'll see, we'll test it out. What the hell am I doing? Oof, that was close. It does seem to do quite a decent amount of damage, so it's probably fine. So close. Thank you. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the reload stone. I do have one blank. It doesn't charge. Okay. And now we're screwed because I'm an idiot. Okay, 
Okay, I have the reload stone. Hopefully we can make it this time. If the two of those. Okay. Come on. Come on. Yes. I don't know why I do this to myself every time. It's always so tense and it doesn't have to be, I just suck. I did take the bullet, I did, that's fine. Let's go kill the soldiers past. I think we accomplished everything so far that we wanted to accomplish. We got the uh, the elevator guy done and we got the soldiers past maybe, we'll see, hopefully. I think his past is the toughest one to, to get rid of, to kill. But we'll see, maybe I'll... Maybe I was wrong, maybe I remember wrong. Maybe it's not that tough. Wasted the bullet. No. Okay, here we go. And there's the boss. He has this, like, poison, or whatever the fuck it is. And he does this. Oh, God. And he summons more enemies, which is also really annoying. And they have quite a lot of HP, too. It's like that they're not just useless. God damn it, die already. into it. still have two hearts and two blanks, I should be fine, hopefully. I'm just gonna use one here. Nice, we got him. became a hero and another past is done now for the next uh, episode I'll probably play a pilot and try to get the robot all the way down maybe I'll try to go to the final stage maybe ok let's return to the bridge and check out the shop, I guess. Uh, wrong character. Oh, what do you have? The devolver. Silver bullets. I think silver bullets are nice, if I'm not wrong. Uh, the professor is still not here. I think he usually stands there. Oh god, these guys are expensive. 
well that's it see you in episode number 10 i think goodbye